here is Peanut, Dale Creasy Jr., and Robert Hyde. This is the place where Robert earned his funny car license in 2004. Well, Robert Hyde in that left-hand lane obviously has the uh, advantage here over uh, Dale Creasy. Dale Creasy probably one of the low-buck racers out there, and obviously with Team Force, the, uh, no problem with resources over at, at, with that team. And remember, this was last year. This was uh, they won the race here. Your defending champion, Robert Hyde, is. It was the third in a row when he kind of got on a roll last season that uh, led him to be a number one in the points, or well, he's either one or two in the points when the countdown started, and then he fell off the face of the earth. So they were really running well this time last season and they're hoping they can uh, capitalize on that and do that again this year. Dale Creasy Jr. last raced here in 2003 when he lost in first round. Robert Hyde is the defending champion here at Topeka. that proc rocket go robert Hyde takes the win over creasy a 409 309 mile an hour pass and now robert height will face matt hagan in the second round well dale creasy gave him a race for a little bit he had the advantage off of the starting line and then about 100 feet out look how close dale got towards uh, the wall at the finish line off he stepped off the throttle just before the before the stripe and uh, saved the paint job on that right side of the car Let's go to Stat Guy. You're thinking about John Force. No doubt about that. Think about this. Only one first-round loss here for John Force in the past 22 years racing here at this Topeka race. It was to Gary Selzy in 2007. Here's my connection. He's a great friend of Jim Head. Two degrees. There you go. See? It works. 